I think we're all going to be taking your class in the fall, uh, James. Uh, thank you so much for sharing that. Uh, and I'd just like to add that, uh, uh, and I'm hoping I can still maybe a little sense of urgency. This. Again, I don't want to wait till two months before an election and we're panicking and making phone calls. Let's, let's start now. Uh, on all of your seats, I put a couple of business cards, Lowndes County Democratic Party. I've been passing them out like crazy. Uh, I went as far yesterday, I was at Publix, and I put a card, I saw somebody had an Obama sticker, and I put a card right in there. With the <laughs> yeah. so, they might not have been happy about it, but they, I think that's the kind of thing we need to do. Uh, so if you have any ideas, please uh, bring them forward. Um, are there any other members uh, who are wishing to be heard in the announcements? Yes, sir. Because a bill was introduced in the Georgia House Representative, House Bill 10, that would make it illegal to operate a motor vehicle while using a handheld cell phone. Now, the Georgia State Patrol issued a report in 2013 that stated that more accidents have been attributed to the use of handheld cell phones while operating a motor vehicle than drunk driving. It's dangerous. It kills people. In states where this law has been in effect long enough to get any reliable information, it is a proven fact that this law will reduce accidents and deaths. We need to contact our local representatives and all representatives for that goes, and if it passes the House, we need to contact our state senators. We need to get this law passed because there's no question it prevents accidents, it saves lives, it could be your life or mine. So we need all of the help we can get to get this law passed. Thank you. Great.